We will guide you through how you can remove parental controls from your PS4. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like and let's get into this. So first up, we start off in the main menu of our main account or primary account on our PS4. After we have made sure that we are on our primary account, we swipe up using our left analog. Then we move over to the second to last option in this section called settings. We select that. After we get into settings, we scroll down once and we select the parental control slash family management. We open that up as well. And then we can choose from a plethora of different methods. So the first option is PS4 system re restrictions. This will change the uh, parental controls for the default uh, PlayStation 4. So it will change for every user regardless of uh, its specifications. Then we have the family management. Then we have the section where we can change the parental controls for a separate user. The two options that we will use in this video is the PS4 system restrictions and the applicable user section. Let's start off in PS4 system restrictions. We open that up. We enter the passcode if we have set up one. If not, the default passcode is 000. Let's write 000. Then we make sure everything is on allowed. So first off, new user creation. We select that and then we make sure it's on allowed. We select allowed. Web filter. Web filter is only used by people who have bought the actual web filter. So if you haven't, uh, don't need, you don't need to mess around with it. If you have, just go into here, select this trend micro for PS4 settings. Open it up, write your passcode once more, and here you make sure that both of these options are unchecked. Let's go back now. Then we have the default parental controls. We open that up, and here we make sure that everything is unallowed. For example, maybe for you it will be level 10, but to make it unallowed, you swipe up and get to the allowed option and then press the X button. Here we select the age level for Blu-ray disc, we make sure that everything is on allowed right here and that we have the proper country or region selected. Then we go into use of PlayStation VR, we select that and we make sure that, it is, that it's on allowed as well. Then we go into use of internet browser, we make sure it's on allowed as well. Now let's exit this. Temporarily disable PS4 system restrictions. This is not necessary since we have removed all of the parental restrictions on this, P this PS4, so you don't need to check it, but if you want to temporarily disable them, you can check this option. Then here in the last option, you can change the system restriction passcode. Let's select it. And at the top, you can enter your new passcode and at the bottom, you can enter the passcode again. Let's go. Let's go back since I want to cancel. Let's go. And now I'll show you how to change it for specific users. For example, this is an applicable user on my PS4. I select it. I write the passcode once again. And as in the default parental controls, you set up everything on allowed. You select age level for games. You make sure it's on allowed. Then you go into age level for Blu-ray disc. You make sure that everything is on allowed and the proper country or region is selected. Then swipe down use of PlayStation VR. Make sure it's on allowed. Then we have use of internet browser. We select it and we make sure it's on allowed. That is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.